Uh, I'm Barry Cohen. I'm an interventional cardiologist with associates in cardiovascular disease and the medical director of the Cardiac Catheterization Laboratory at Morristown Memorial Hospital. Interventional cardiology is the branch of cardiology where we treat both arteries, valves, and other areas in structural heart disease, such as patients with stroke, with catheter-based technologies to be minimally invasive and to improve the patient's life and alter the structure of the heart. We have a, pro a protocol for patients with heart attacks where hopefully they will call 911, get to the emergency room as soon as possible because the earlier they come to the emergency room, the better their chances of making it are. We have an interventional cardiologist, either myself or colleagues, who are available 24 hours a day, seven days a week. When we see a patient, we get called and we respond immediately and we try to get arteries open within 90 minutes of the, of the time they arrive to the emergency room. An example of a heart attack is patients who have plaque in the artery and millions of people have plaque in arteries and for some reason the, the things become active and a blood clot forms totally blocking the channel. The heart muscle downstream from this artery is then deprived of blood and starts to die. The longer it's blocked, the artery is blocked, the worse the heart attack is and the more likely one has of not making it or having severe disability. When we, when we have patients with heart attacks, we take them to the catheterization laboratory and this is how we treat them. We put in stents, which are stainless steel metal devices that prop the artery open and stay in permanently. This is a balloon that is the delivery system for the stent that is withdrawn at the end of the procedure and the patient hopefully goes home within the next day or two in much better shape than when they came in.